Okay, Jovs Barra made a first time reaction to Wandering by James Taylor. Whoa, hey, it's Matt Crisqualo coming to you up close and personal. Let's do this, guys. I don't know. I, this is the second time I'm reacting to Jobs Barometer because you guys out there told me I should react to him. And that's what I'm doing. I'm here for you. If you can, out of the kindness of your heart, check out the description below. And if any of those things look like you might be able to support the channel in any capacity, that would be great too. If not, hey, I'm just happy you showed up. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell icon. Stay in touch. And let's check out some great music together and see what Jobs has to say. What do you got to say, Jobs? Huh? You talking to me? I've been wandering early and late From New York City to the Golden Gate And I don't look like I never stop on a wandering My daddy was an engineer My brother's driving hand My sister takes a laundry while a baby boss to change Yeah, yeah. Well, that's a great. It's a nice. It's a nice James Taylor song. You know, you can't go wrong with James Taylor. Great, great musician, composer, artist, all that stuff. And then Jobs. You know, Jobs. Jobs. I don't know how to say his name. If you could let me know, that would be great. But yeah, he's a very tasteful musician. You know, I like what he's doing. He's got a nice touch. He's got a nice little guitar that he's playing on. What kind of guitar is that? I have a friend that has that guitar. I want to say Ovation, but I can't remember exactly. Maybe we'll see it on the neck, um, on the tuning uh, part of the neck. But at any rate, I like his style. You know, I, I've done a bunch of reactions to Alip Bata. I don't know if you're aware of that. If not, go to my channel and check it out. Um, but uh, this guy is another one of those cats from, uh, I guess, Indonesia or the Philippines and just playing great music. Here we go. And my she died when I was shy. My daddy did steal a big and pet. And I don't look like the rest of my wandering. He stakes in the ocean, it's at a sea. Yeah, yeah, very, very cool. I mean, it's interesting the way this guy Jobs records. So far, the, the two recordings that I've seen, he's doing it, look, it looks like he's in the forest, you know, somewhere in Indonesia or something. I don't know. It just That's what it looks like to me. That's what I'm imagining. I'm imagining also that it must not be easy to maybe keep that guitar in tune if there's any kind of moisture in the air with warpage and, you know, things like that. I don't know, but... You know, but I do like that he's, the way he's recording it. I like that he's sitting there, you know, outside. I think it's kind of romantic and kind of charming and cozy in a way. As long as there isn't any, like, you know, big snakes or gorillas or any kind of orangutan. I, what what kind of animals are over there? I know that, you know, if you if you start recording something like this in the woods in America, you know, you, you could end up with a bear, you know, uh, as a fan. and And you don't want a bear as a fan. 
Um, but what what goes on over there? Is he going to get you know some kind of a big python come through and because that'll mess the song up. That would really mess the song up. Anyway, I really enjoyed that. Um, I'm looking. This is again. I keep on going with this guy Jobs uh, Barameda. Should I keep on going? Let me know if you have any requests. I would appreciate it. But yeah. I mean, what can I say? I only have listened to a couple of things by him so far. This is the second one, and I'm in, I'm digging it. I'm digging it. I'd like to know a little bit more about his setup, though. I'd like to know, is he playing steel strings, nylon? I see that he plays with a thumb pick, and then he's got the rest with finger style. Uh, his guitar looks pretty slick. I've seen it before. I just don't remember the name of it. And, you know, and listen, man. We got to support these guys. These guys are, are are great musicians. They're doing what they love. They know that it's a grind. It's a struggle. They don't make a lot of money doing this. So if they have a YouTube channel like this, you know, subscribe to their channel too, because it helps them. Um, and uh, because uh, especially when you get these pandemics and there's no live performances anywhere, that's how these guys actually, you know, try to make a little bit of a living. At any rate, guys, that's just my take on things. You could keep it or you could throw it down. Whatever you want to do, it's up to you. And wherever this is going, I'll be there. I hope that you're there too. And look, it's nice to be important, but more important to be nice. And you take it easy. And if it's real easy, <laughs> take it twice.